Hey guys, what's going on? It's Mr. Pizzazz here, and today is a little something special. I, I always say that from my recording for some reason. I was like, oh, that's something special, it's something different. Um, well, this is something different. Um, hopefully, many of you guys have seen this game. Uh, this game is actually DayZ. Now, DayZ is pretty much a post-apocalyptic zombie survival game, and it is basically insanely popular, and it's been popular for a while. Uh, the standalone Alpha is being released later this month in July. And I believe the, uh, I believe that game's gonna be sweet. <laughs> but anyways, um, I played this game like a year ago when it first was released, this mod rather. And I played it probably twice and I died within 10 minutes. So I pretty much just, just gave up on it. And then I started, I picked this game up about two weeks ago and I started playing. And I played it three or four times, kept dying. So I took a week break and I started playing it like two days ago. And it was actually my first successful life. I lived for about five hours. Not like consecutively, like not in a row. But I lived for like two hours a night and then three hours the next day. And I had like a ghillie suit. I got an RSASS and RSAS, whatever you want to call it. I got all this shit. See, I came over here because I kind of thought, ooh, what the? Kind of thought this was going to be like a sign to tell me like which cities were up ahead. But uh, apparently it's not. Just a guy holding fucking sunflowers. Okay, we're gonna run around with the, run along with the coast to our left. Uh, our plan here is to get to Cherno, which is like one of the biggest cities on the coast. It is the biggest city, and I think it's the biggest city in the game. I I'm not, I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure it's the biggest city in the game. So we're gonna try to. Get there. <laughs> So I was on my way to Cherno, just walking, you know, and uh, I heard a noise. Now, it sounded like a mic, like kind of like <laughs> like ruffling, you know? That's probably a bad example. But yeah, that's what I heard. And uh, my channel right now is on direct communication. So I believe, I'm not positive, he could have been speaking in like the global channel, so I could have heard him, like everybody could have heard him. But if he was speaking in the direct channel, that means he's really close. So I'm just going to uh, to look around. Be, be cautious, you know. Be myself. Oh, uh, shit. What is over here? Doesn't look like much is over here, quite honestly. I think I might, uh, I think I, oh, wait. Lighthouse. Lighthouse. Okay, we found our first building, guys. We're going to go head up here and see what's up. I was about to say, I think I'm going to turn on and head over with the coast on my right. Okay, these fucking idiots are speaking on global. That, that's annoying as shit. Thank you. Uh, what they're like, this fucking pizzazz guy's a fucking cunt, ban him. I hope not, dude, that'd be bad. Anyways, we're, we were up checking this lighthouse, I believe. English not very good. All right. Yeah, I don't know if you should me mumble. My English not very good, but I was thinking of typing that in the chat just so like if they call me retarded, I can pretend that I'm foreign and I'll have an excuse to be retarded. Where the fucking lighthouse go? Seriously, where the shit is? Where the shit is it? Oh, it's right there. How did I miss that? Are there any zombies? Dude, if they're zombies, we're screwed. Okay. Let's see. I'm beatboxing. That's what I do when I'm stressed. Kidding. I don't I don't get to Dude! I know where we are, I think. I think. I think. Okay. Either Cherno is over that way, or it's over that way. 
So, I mean, I've played, I, I've been here before, I think. I, I've seen that bridge, like, quite a few times. I don't know if there's another bridge like it, like, just identical or something, but we'll see. Let's go up here. Plan letter up. So, yeah, anyways, guys, the first time, for, first couple times I played this game, I died because this game is kind of hard to, uh, kind of hard to, like, pick up, you know, and get used to. And I was actually with my buddy Steve. He'll probably be in this, uh, if, if I make this a series, which I'm not sure if I'm going to, if I do, it'll probably be, like, pretty awesome again <laughs> but um if i do once again uh steve will probably make a couple appearances in because i like to play with him on this game but unfortunately steve is actually quite terrible at this game i think his average of lifetime is like 11 minutes like the only time he survived longer is when he had to like leave the server and tell me exactly where he's at and then i had to walk over there and then once i was at the spot where he logged off he logged back on and then we found a bus, which is kind of weird. We found a bus, like, two seconds later. So we got in that bus, and we went over towards Starry. Uh, there was a zombie, and we had to refuel. So I got out, and it attacked me, and I lost blood, and I didn't have any bandages, and neither did Steve, and I died. That's how that went. Not very fun to record. I mean, it could have been cool because, like, I was raiding Cherno and shit, but other than that, not very fun. Okay, so I'm going to keep walking here, and uh, hopefully we found... Oh, what's that? That's a ship. That is a ship. Okay. Anyways, guys. Did I hear a zombie? Oh! Oh! Shit! There's a zombie. We encounter our first zombie. We're just gonna swim. Because they can't swim well. Go. Dun 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 dun. guys what's going on uh, apparently we were just walking and we ran into this town which i believe is uh something with a k but it is before it is before cherno either it's before it's in between electro and cherno i'm pretty sure so we just uh wandered into this house um i tried to go around the other way but i aggroed some zombies so i had to lose them first we we're gonna wander in this house this looks like there's some loot here but it looks like a bunch of trash right now whoops what the hell's going on there okay see yeah it's just empty cans we don't really need those but we don't need those at all we don't really need those is another way to say we don't need those at all let's check to see if there's yeah okay there's more over here this looks this looks way more promising looks like a can of soda yeah yeah box of matches yes all right cool now what that means is uh if we find a hatchet we can harvest wood kill some animals and make a fire and cook those and that will help us regain our blood so Okay, some chem lights. Let's get those. Now, from my understanding, chem lights, I believe it's uh, during nighttime. If you throw chem lights or flares down, they attract zombies to them. So if you are getting like chased and zombies lose sight of you for a little bit and you pop one of those bad boys down and take off, the zombies will be more attracted to that chem light than they will be to you. Okay, let's kind of crawl here really quietly. Doesn't look like there's many, many zombies nearby. Let's well, corner. It's corner hack right here. Look around this corner. No, we're good. Okay, I'm gonna speed up my crouch walk a little bit because I want to get through this town quite fast. I don't want to stay here. It's over there. Okay, that looks like a train station going in over there. Uh, we might have to head over there see what's in there. Okay, there's a zombie right there. Tell me if you guys. Ooh, you hear that? That's a zombie. Tell me if you guys hear anything. And then, uh, if you do, I'll be sure to hear you, uh, in the future telling me to run, and then I'll run. It's corner glitch here. Corner glitch is basically, like, when you're in third person, you can look around the corner and see a zombie like that before it sees you, because you're not actually around the corner, you know what I mean? I wish there was ability to do that in real life. That'd be pretty cool, actually. You could probably, like, sneak up on hot girls changing and shit, but they wouldn't even know you're there. All right, let's vault this motherfucker. Okay. I don't know if that's a zombie up there or what, but we got a little shed here. Of course, can't go in it. I don't know why I got my hump. Okay, corner, corner, corners. Check your corners. Check your corners. Stay frosty. 
That's what the motto is for this playthrough. Stay frosty. All right. Oh, shit. See, it's so I. Okay, there's a zombie right there. I have, still haven't distinguished like the uh, the sounds of aggro zombies versus like non aggro zombies. So whenever I hear just a regular zombie. Most of the time, I'll just freak out. Okay, we can see that zombie hop in there. By the way, guys, if you're wondering, I don't really want to head over this way. I mean, I could try to vault over here. This guy looks like he's... Yeah, we're going to try to take a risky move here. By the way, anyways... Oh, shit, shit. No, he's turning around. Ooh, prone, 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 prone. Quick. Okay, we're in high grass here, so we should be very hard to detect. Nearly invisible to these zombies. Of course, watch as soon as I say that the zombie's gonna get aggroed and come attack me. By the way, guys, uh, I was typing in the chat, um, like, is anybody in Cherno? And it pretty much said there's at least 15 people in Cherno. So once we get there, that's when the fun's gonna start, is what I, I imagine. I'm, I'm contemplating just running straight through this neighborhood, but I feel like I'd aggro all the zombies in the entire fucking neighborhood if I do anything like that. Plus, there could be some some loots chilling out. Well, that's kind of convenient. We can just crawl. Oh, wait, wait. I see something. Tank trap. We want it? Fuck yeah, we want it. I don't know how to place that. I've never gotten that before, so... Okay, let's, let's get back up to our couch here. No need to be... Oh, that's that's walking. No need to be super careful. Let's get a trot going. Okay, looking over this wall. Is that house open? It doesn't look like that house is open. I, it, looked, it looked like it could have been open, but it's not. That warehouse has definitely got to be open. Should we try to head over there? I think we should. I'm talking to myself. Ignore that. I'm talking to myself for your entertainment, so... It justifies the fact that I'm actually talking to myself. Okay. So right here. See, there's like so many topics that I want to address. Like as soon as I start talking, I can easily ramble. But I don't want to because then I feel like I'll distract you guys from the gameplay. And I'll also distract myself. So, oh shit. Like that when I accidentally just stand up. Don't see any zombies. That's weird. Okay. Yeah, we're good. This whole street is clear, basically. Except the fucking chicken. Goddamn cocks in the row, dude. All the time. That tower looks, like, suspicious. Looks like it, it's begging for me to go over and look at it. But, uh, Pizazz doesn't reply to beggars, so we're not going to go over there. So, what I got of this neighborhood is... Goddamn cocks everywhere, dude. Anyways, what I got of this neighborhood was a soda can. A, uh, what's this? Is this a loot pile? Don't think this is a loot pile. It might be, though. Oh, 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 no, no. All I successfully did there was aggro zombie. Oh, shit, no, I didn't. He's just... He's in the hut. I say we take off. Run away while he's distracted in the hut. He's having his good, he's having his lovely good time in there. That was funny because I was actually about to say let's go investigate in that little hut. Good thing I didn't because that would have been that would have been bad. Okay, guys, I think we have a uh, we have another long run ahead of us. We had our fun in that little town, and now we're gonna move on and put on the big boy pants. And move on to Cherno. Hey guys, what's going on? We just took another walk, and it looks like I misinterpreted where I was in the map because I believe, um, after doing a little bit of research when I tabbed out on my browser, that is a zombie crawling in the streets. First it was Cox, now it's zombies. Anyways, after doing a little bit of research, I came across this sign, and I looked it up, and I was like, okay, that kind of reminds me of Electro, and it turns out that Electro in Russian is actually that. I don't know if this... I don't know if Russian is the right word to use there or what language, but yeah. 
So we're going to Electro. It looks like there's an open warehouse over here behind the zombie, and we're going to try to head over that way. Yeah, he's he's going to go. He's heading off to the uh, direction to the left. Unless he suddenly changes his direction, we should be okay. I don't know if this building is open. There's, there's another crawling zombie. There's like three zombies in front of that warehouse. We have to be careful. Plus, if I'm right and this is Electro, I would be, not would not be surprised if there are survivors in here. I gotta complain here because this guy's gonna get fucking welcome, but nobody welcomed his ass. Nobody welcome possess said this. Oh shit. I mean the zombie having to crawl off. Oh god. Wait, no, he's heading that way now. <laughs> Dude, it honestly feels like he sees me. He just can't. Holy shit, I'm getting a Okay, I'm gonna mute my phone real quick. Okay, there there he goes. There he goes. He's now he's going off. I was about to say it honestly looks like he's like locking eyes with me and just matching every my move. Pizzazz, 4SFG welcomes you to Below the Buddies. Yes! Or somebody. That, okay, they can't even go in that door, apparently. That guy's like me, dude. He hasn't played it in like a year. Okay, that... Zombies crawling. It'd be kind of funny if I just have to like. Oh shit! He sees me. Should I just sprint? Should I sprint? Yeah, he definitely for sure sees me. God damn it! Now he's a runner. Run! No, why would I vault? Run, we're gonna run through this warehouse and see what we can do. See if we can cause some mayhem. Or maybe we can close the doors. I don't know. We're just gonna, oh, I don't, I don't think they can run buildings. So if they if that's true, then we are in luck. There's nothing in here. We gotta find more buildings. Fuck it, we're just gonna run. Dude, I don't even care. Oh, a bus. Hey, I might take you, except it looks like it has no wheels. Unfortunately. I could get in the bus and... It has fuel and shit, but it's not... There's, like, no wheels. Yeah, there's... It's missing, like, one wheel, dude. That's gay. Okay, let's hop in here. Oh, cool. Oh, a zombie. What is that? The gear, yeah. A G17 mag. Ah, oh, no, I got hit. Whoops. Let me out. Let me out. We gotta run. We gotta run. We gotta fight. The part. Run away. I was gonna say party, but we gotta run away. Oh, shit, 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 shit. I was about to say, am I still being chased? But uh, I'll take that as a yes when I look back and see zombies. I'm bleeding, but not badly, so... Okay, you know what? Screw it. We're going to try to bandage. So we don't... See this blood over here? This is uh, our blood, and the plus sign means that we are losing blood. Run. Oh, shit. I interrupted the bandaging process. We are still losing blood, and we are losing it fast. Goddamn zombies. Okay, we got to get them in the water. That's what we got to do. What is that? I think that's... More of Cherno, it's like another piece. Come on in the zombie water, the water zombies. I mixed up my words there. I meant to say, come on in the water zombies, but I said, come on in the zombies water. Which we don't want to come in the zombies water. That would be a catastrophe. I wonder if those, like, yeah, no, that's a bad idea. I was about to, I had a theory going in my mind, but it was kind of nasty. 
I'm not even going to say it. I just I would embarrass myself, and I would embarrass the people that I represent. I would embarrass the Pizzazz franchise. I would embarrass my my existence as a whole. Okay, I think I lost them. Which is good, because now I can bandage. Oh, my canteen is basically gone, but good thing I have a Coke bottle. Okay, bandage. Yes. That's my theme music because uh, I had to cut back on funds and I can't afford to buy actual theme music. So all sounds you hear in this game are indeed coming from my mouth. I'm joking. Not all sounds you hear in this game. All the sounds that you can distinguish as my voice are indeed from my voice. Unlike before where I would go on iTunes and search Pizzazz Commentaries and I would download those and upload those but now I have to cut back on funds so I actually have to commentate which is unfortunate but it, you know people make sacrifices every day I figured one little sacrifice by Mr. Pizzazz wouldn't do much okay we're swimming again and I'm not a fan of swimming looks like there's a church over there There's that uh, music that we had to cut back in funds again. Okay, you know what? Actually, before we go in this town, I think I'm going to situate up on this hill here, get a nice view, and say goodbye to you guys because I am in the floor of the sea. Okay, anyways, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I am Mr. Pizzazz. This is Daisy. Uh, if you guys want to see more episodes of this, please let me know in the comments, and I will be sure to put more episodes of this. Thanks, guys, for watching once again, and it would be awesome if you guys could leave a like. It lets me know that I have supporters out there and people that want to watch my videos. All right, see you guys. Hey, guys, it's Mr. Pizzazz, and I am back from the death of that video that you just watched. I, I was resurrected to tell you this message. So if you guys have been paying attention, if you're subscribed to me and you watch my videos like you're supposed to, then you would have noticed that I started a Metro Last Light playthrough. However, there was, like, a two-week break that I took, and the reason for that break was because I had to go on vacation to Colorado, which was honestly, if I had one word to sum it all up, it'd be orgasmic. That vacation was pretty fucking solid. So I'm sorry about that, guys, but the uploads are going to be started regularly very soon if not already and uh, I'm actually another message I want you guys to know is please let me know in the comments if you want me to start like a daisy playthrough or something because like right now I wasn't recording it and I got a bunch of cool shit like a ghillie suit and mt49 saw and stuff so you guys that's pretty much it uh, that's all I needed to tell you so once again please let me know in the comments and if you like this video please give it a like it uh, lets me know that you support me and I'll see you guys all in a later video